Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today's adventure begins. Guess where? Universal Studios. Where else would it be, right? <laughs> Close to Halloween. We can't keep ourselves away. So we're back here again to show you some more merch and also the updates on the Halloween Horror Nights. Here. Yes, today is the first day of Halloween Horror Nights. Or the first night. But we're not here for uh, Halloween Horror Nights tonight. We're here to film um, all of the new merch and uh, see where all the scare zones are and stuff like that, and houses. And also, the mummy has reopened, which is our favorite ride. Yep. So we're gonna hopefully ride that. Yeah, and also that tribute store is open. Yes. Yeah, and um, we see some pictures online. It looks really cool. We, well, we got like uh, a few photo opportunities. There's some some coffins that you know you can pose with and, and take pictures with. So it'll it'll come out looking cool, and we want to get that done. And also just enjoy the atmosphere at Universal Studios. It's just right now the weather is yes. cooperating because we're, on our drive here it was raining a bit. I got a little scared to tell you the truth, but right now. It's, it's maybe like a 78 or so, and it's breezy. Yeah, I, I can deal so, with that. Hope it stays this way. Yeah, fingers crossed. Yeah, I'm very, very excited about the tribute store, <laughs> so stay tuned. All right, right as you come in the entrance, they have this giant pumpkin here. They've got the archway here all decked out. We got the number 31. Halloween Horror Nights number 31. Just how old I am. <laughs> just kidding. We'll just say that. Yeah. yeah. Look at all these jack-o'-lanterns. They say you have to find little boo up here. You gotta find little boo. Yeah. No, it's not a little boo. A little tiny pumpkin with a smiley face. I don't see him. I wonder if they moved him. They might have moved him just to fool everybody. Yeah, he was right here in the middle. I didn't see little Boo. We must have moved him. He used to be like in the center somewhere, up high. Here's one of the food trucks. They got some carnival games up already. This is cute. More games. They got a stay puff over there. All right, we found two more booths over here by the Jimmy Fallon area. sandwich when it first hit the menu it was like $14.99 and a lot of people were complaining so they changed the price now. Alright and this booth is called Trick or Treat. I just spoke with a security guard and she said that this haunted horseshoe was really good. I'm gonna take your order. I would like the haunted horseshoe. I've heard it's really good. It is. Yes. I suggest you get a drink with it. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's only like 12 bucks. Oh really. sure, I'll get four. <laughs> uh, the popcorn looks uh, like it might be good. I don't know. Yeah, blood splattered kettle corn. Can't go wrong with that. All right, we have a booth over here that's open, so I'm gonna check that out. 
Hi. I've heard that the lacto cooler is pretty good. I'm not sure if these are, I guess they're alcoholic drinks. There's another one right next to it with Dracula. Petrified rat tails. Wow, major sweets ice cream sandwich. So the mummy is open, so we'll ride that in a bit. Okay, everybody, places we are rolling and action. <laughs> Got some corn. Oh, cool. Love how it lights up. Even tomorrow if I have to. We gotta go find out. Pick at your own risk. Pumpkin Lord. Yeah, I like this shirt. It's thirty dollars. All hail the Pumpkin Lord. Pretty cool. You got a card magnet here as well. You got uh, pins. All about Universal Studios Halloween Horror Nights thirty one. Pretty cool. We even got some candles here. Entering the Hollow Hill Cemetery.
David has found the coffin. These uh, remind me of Beetlejuice. Cauldron Cottage. Oh, see somebody's foot in the cauldron. Frankenstein popcorn buckets. We got a ton here. Stained glass yeah. uh, window, but obviously it's a screen. So, yeah, it's a TV screen. See, they got a ton of. Might get one of these later. Oh yeah. Halloween phone cases. Wow, that was a really cool tribute store. Like every room was just uniquely designed and probably my favorite tribute store yet. And I know yeah. I said that about the last one, but they keep getting better and better. Yeah, since this I'm is Halloween. Of, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of like um, still thinking about how cool they got it and you know the the creation team or the team creators or whatever what magic they did there. It's so cool. You got that creepy vibe going. 
and it it feels legit. It feels like you're in a like a real cemetery. It feels like you're you're hanging out somewhere else other than Universal Studios. So it kind of takes you to a different place. They just they just so good. That's what they do. Alright, we're gonna go ride the mummy now. Alright, so only a 35 minute wait for the mummy. Yes, the long awaited ride since it's reopening for us. It's been Last like seven, seven months? Seven months, yeah. <laughs> Just like how I imagined. Man, it got me a little creeped out, but that's how it's supposed to be. I was so scared, it was so dark, off it lit up, and that fire, and they got the water there. Oh my God! I'm telling you, still one of my favorite rides, guys. Come check it out. Boom! <laughs> yeah, I can't really tell, like, they haven't changed too much. No, nah, not at all, at least to my knowledge. I noticed like a little bit towards the end, we went down like a hill and there was like some red lights. I don't remember that before. Uh, you notice that? All I know is everything was just as clean and as nice as I remembered it to be. And it, it worked out perfectly. I had yeah. the thrill like I had before. So two thumbs up, guys. Yeah, they might have like brightened up some of the graphics. Right, yeah, and, something um, like that. The screen is clear. You get spritzed with a little bit of water. I don't remember yeah. that last time. Uh, just like every now and then they do yeah. it. I mean, it's it's just like, oh, skin or miss. Yeah, but so cool. still an awesome ride. Yeah, the main goal is to get you creeped out and scared like you were in the tomb with the mummy. Yeah. And that's the feeling I always get. It's like they know how to convey that point across. Ooh, almost got uh, run over there by a little car, a scooter. <laughs> All right, so let's keep moving. Hey guys, you got room for one more? <laughs> <laughs> and the moon's gonna take me right around away right over here.
like this pumpkin food booth. They have churro, dog on a stick, maggot covered cheese dog. Ugh. light up at night it'll look really cool all right we're gonna go see if we can find something to eat yeah getting really hungry now the croissant i had this morning is long gone we're eating at the crusty burger but we got ourselves some hot dogs look it's called the heat lamp dog and it's plain old 100 percent all beef hot dog and let me see how it tastes Oh my god, <laughs> that bread tastes as plain as one of the white bread and <laughs> tastes like a regular Nathan's hot dog. So you can't go wrong. Yep. And some curly fries. Oh, yeah. Also, it's looking like it might rain, so we're hoping it holds off for a little while, hopefully a few more hours. We had to be out of the park by five because we're not staying for Halloween Horror Nights. We'll be back next weekend for that. So we're just chilling here by the water. Drinking a nice cold water. So refreshing. It cooled it cool down a lot. So like this is so nice to be out here and without having the sun beat on you. Ooh. Yeah, still waiting to see if it's gonna rain been lightning a little bit. shop here next to the red dead coconut. I like this shirt right here. That's cool. This is the perfect shirt for David since he loves to play poker. Behind. Okay. Exactly what it's like. Alright, that's gonna be it for today's video. We are about to leave the park and people are still coming in for Halloween Horror Nights. See here. Got a feeling it's gonna be packed tonight. Alright, so the next video we have something special planned, so you might want to stay tuned for that. Alright, we're going to get out of here and try to beat the traffic. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Bay Adventures. Thanks for watching!